Hey guys, welcome to another lunchtime review. I'm filming through my front window, so it may be a little dirty, but it'll just live because it's cold. Um, this is uh, Chipotle. I'm going to try this out. I've been here before and um, I've always liked it. So we'll, I'm going to try it out and show you what it looks like. And uh, I'm going to go inside and order and then I'll be back and I'll tell you what I got. All right, got back out. It wasn't that bad. Let me, um, hold on, let me get my receipt out. Didn't think this through before I got it. Um, I got chips, just an order of the chips. I love their chips. And the uh, bowl, this is the rice bowl, of course. It uh, was the total. I did not get a drink, so um, I had a water already. So for the chips in the bowl, it was $8.25 uh, with tax. It was $8.75, so not too bad. Um, the bowl was, um, let's see, I got the white rice, uh, black beans, which I actually like their black beans, um, chicken, the um, a little bit of salsa, some sour cream, and some cheese. And that's what's... That's what you see in there. So, and then the chips are the lime uh, chips. So I'm gonna flip this camera around and I'm gonna try a bite. All right, it's cold outside, so I got my coat on this time. So I'm gonna try a bite of this. I always, um, always like theirs with the chips. If you get the chips, um, I usually just dip the chips in this and get the chips and uh, the stuff in the bowl together. But I figured I would try a bite for you since um, you, know, you wanna see it hear what it tastes like without the bowl or without the chips I mean so just kind of stir it all up that's how I do it at least some people might not like to stir it up they might like to leave it um, you know whole in there and uh, I don't know that's up to you okay I think I got a little bit of everything in this bite hmm. I'll tell you what sour cream really makes things taste good. Good and creamy. I love that this is not, um, it's got a nice seasoning to it, but it's not too spicy. That is really, really good. Um, and this bowl is full. I mean, you stir it up and you get a whole bowl of this. I, used, I got the burrito once, because you can get this wrapped in a burrito um, shell, and it was just too much. The, the burrito, you have to kind of pick it up and eat it. I'd much rather eat it on a fork. Um, it's so much easier. Mm. That is super good. I love it with the, uh, throw me my mouth on. The um, chicken has a really good flavor. Like I said, it's it's seasoned, but it's not spicy. Um, it The sour cream just adds a lot of flavor to the, the mix of very creamy tasting. And the beans and the salsa is just it's just all really good so what i usually do is i take my chip after i stir it up i just take a chip and dip in there i eat it and you got plenty of chips to dip in here one thing you couldn't do with a burrito too is you can't dip you can't dip a chip in a burrito so yeah this is excellent excellent um my only complaint if i had to complain is it's not super hot like heat hot i mean it's okay but it could be hotter um the rice is not very hot and the chicken is not very hot the um i mean it's it's lukewarm almost room temperature but not quite it's it's lukewarm but they put them in these big pans sitting in the, you know, the pans that sit under, on top of the water pan that, that they heat the water up and the water is supposed to keep the pan on top hot. Um, that's what they do there. And if it's fresh, it's right straight out of the kitchen, it is really good and hot. But if it's been sitting there for a little while, those, those, um, those kind of pans just don't keep things hot that long. That being said, don't bother me any. I'm going to still eat it because it's really good. So I'm going to give this one. I'm going to give their meals like a four and a half. Um, not quite a five because it could be hotter. Again, that's, you know, if I go in right now, it might be hot. But, the, you know, you know what? No, I'll give it a four and a half. Because um, the flavors are really good. It, it seems like there could be elevated with just a little bit more. But you can add all kinds of different stuff to your meal too. You can get guacamole. You could do... Um, they do have some spicy stuff in there if you want it spicier. So you can put spicy salsa or something like that on there. So there's all kinds of different things you can add to change the flavors. Still think it's about a four and a half. I really wish it was hotter, but beyond that, it's still pretty good. So I hope you enjoy this video. Thanks for watching.
And about halfway through, and I forgot to mention, first of all, it was really fast. Uh, the service was really fast. They got to me, I was literally in line probably three minutes, maybe. It's very fast. The uh, the deal with Chipotle is the, um, you go in kind of like a subway. You go in, um, you tell them whether you want a bowl, a burrito. They got all kinds of different options. You tell them what you want. Um, and you go down the line and you tell them what you want to put in it. So I got the rice. <coughs> Sorry. So I got the rice bowl with chicken and, um, you know, just told the ingredients. I could have gotten, um, they have a brown rice instead. I got the lime, the white lime cilantro rice. Um, they also have a brown rice. They have a chicken steak. They have a special chorizo going on right now. Um, I think it was back for a limited time. But I don't really care for chorizo that much, so I didn't order it. I didn't want to, I didn't want to try it out because I don't like it. Um, yeah, so that you just go through the oil line and you just tell them what you want. So um, you can get whatever you want put in there. Um, I think, if I'm not mistaken, guacamole and queso sauce might be extra. I don't. I can't remember. Um, I know the queso sauce. If you get it, the queso sauce on your um, in your bowl, then I know that's extra. But I. I can't imagine eating that. It was kind of a runny cheese looking queso. So I can't imagine that sitting in here because the cream cheese, uh, the sour cream adds enough runniness to it. Uh, I can't imagine adding um, the cheese sauce to it either. But anyway, I just want to tell you that's kind of how you do it. Just in case you don't have one in your area or you've never been before, you uh, you just go in super easy. They got really big pictures and writing on the board. So it really steps you through. Um, it's, it's just whatever looks good to you. So anyway, hope you enjoyed. Talk to you next time.